Hi guys, today I'm gonna share with you a little puppy update video. I feel like I haven't done these one of these probably since bandit was pretty young maybe within the first couple of months so now bandit is nine months old of course dude is going to be in this video as well because a lot of you like to know what's going on with the dude too but bandit is nine months old now i gotta check to see how much he weighs but i'll insert that at some point in the video today i'm going to kind of take you guys around and share with you guys just random clips as they happen throughout the day today of new things that he's doing or differences from when he was a puppy like real small puppy till now hope you guys enjoy this video i just thought it'd be fun to kind of share some cute little clips of him too he really has a fun personality him and dude are hilarious together bandit is really obsessed with the dude as you guys can probably tell but dude sometimes needs his space so it's been really fun having two dogs now, but I'm gonna just share with you guys some little clips. Hope you enjoy, give it a thumbs up if you do enjoy it, and let's go out and get into it. First things first, since the boys were just sitting here on this sofa, they've destroyed it. That is the first update, is that we're gonna have to get rid of this sofa now, which we actually did just buy a different one. Unfortunately, it is super dark gray. So this sofa's on its last leg now. We've had it for probably almost five years now. But they do love it. They love being elevated up on a sofa or something. It's just gotten really, really bad. Fortunately, with IKEA couches, you can take all, all the co covers off and wash it and stuff. But, yeah, I don't know. They just are always destroying it. And I've put this sofa cover on here. And they'll get really hyper and they'll just rip it off. So we're going to have to work on training them to maybe not get on the sofas or to just get them some elevated dog beds or something. We'll see. Hi. So I'm going to show you guys what Bandit knows trick wise. He's, yes, you're very good too. You don't even need to do tricks anymore. You're just so good. Okay. Bandit, come over here. Let's make sure the camera can see ya. Come here. Okay, sit. Good boy. Okay. Can you shake? Other. Good boy. Dude is trying to do it over here <laughs> on the sofa. Good boy. Can you lay down? Down. Good boy. Okay, this one is the one that he has the hardest time with. Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Good boy, dude. Good Roll over. Roll over. Roll over. Good boy. Okay, had to help him out a little bit with that one. But you still did it. Good boys. We'll split this one in half. Now I honestly think the command come is probably the most important things for our dogs to learn. So we've been working on it with Bandit. If he's very distracted outside, it's hard to get him to listen. Dude's very, very good about it. So we just work on him with it. Maybe once a day, even if we just take like five minutes and do a little training with him, it's really, really helpful. And it doesn't hurt to always have some treats in your pocket. Okay hey boys, come. Come here. Sit down. Bandit. Come sit next to the dude. Sit. Okay, boys. Stay. Come. Good boy. Okay, come all the way down here. All the way. Oh, I it. Come. Sit. Sit. Come. Good boy. Another update, we still have this gate 
at the top of our stairs. It's literally because he steals everything of ours. So this is the guest room. He brings everything in here and he runs it all under the bed. He does this with any of our stuff that he can find. Hey, come here. <laughs> it really upsets dude, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't have those. <laughs> You're mine. Those are mine. So he'll get into the laundry basket. Hey! If we, hey! If we it's going right out of my hands. If we leave hey. anything on the floor. Get it it's really not just clothes either. It'll be like a paper or anything. Dang it. Come here. Come here. Give me that. Drop it. Drop it. Good boy. <laughs> yeah, you get him, dude. <laughs> While we're up here, let's get Bandit Wade. Bandit, come here. Come here, Bandit. Come here. Getting Wade. And he's 9.8. Good boy. Oh, that's good. That's good. Good job. Good boy. Okay, and I'm gonna pick you up. <laughs> okay, let's step on the scale. Oops. Joshua's got to weigh himself with Bandit in his arms. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's still, it's not stopped moving. Why does he look so funny? <laughs> Okay, wait, let me guess though. I feel like he's probably 50 pounds. Dude is 75. Or maybe he's like 52 pounds. He's approximately 52 pounds. Oh, really? Yeah. About 52 pounds, Bandit. You've really become a big boy. Dude's like, uh, do I get to be weighed? Sorry, dude, you're just too big. <laughs> yeah, I don't really feel like carrying you. <laughs> oh boy, you're a big boy now. Now look at this brotherly love right here. <laughs> oh, that's really cute. Are you gonna fall asleep? Okay boys, you ready to eat some dinner? Dude, doodle. Yeah, he doesn't really care about food. Okay. So, next I'm going to feed the boys dinner and Bandit right here is a big time foodie. Like he loves his food so much. He started eating it really fast out of his bowl and he would just throw it right up after. So, I ended up getting this other bowl out. I'll show it to you guys. This is the bowl I started using for Bandit. We got this originally for Dude. I think I got it from like TJ Maxx or something. But I'm sure they have them on Amazon. I will find one and link it down below for you guys if you guys are interested. But ever since he started using this bowl, he hasn't thrown up again. So I know that's really gross, but just throwing that out there in case anybody has had any of these issues with their dog eating really fast, this has honestly been a lifesaver. Okay, boys, ready for your food? Do it. Go right here. Good boy. Bandit. Can you sit? Good boy. All right guys, so that's gonna be it for this little puppy update video. I do have one more clip that I wanna share with you guys and that's of Bandit swimming. So I wanna share the before of his first time in the pool when he went swimming cause he was so scared and it was just, I mean he like completely scratched my legs. It was like 
clothes were in. The last time he had his life jacket on and he was out at the lake, it's already cooling down here in Michigan, so he's probably not gonna be in the water for a little while now. The last time he was in the lake, he was much more comfortable. He did have his life jacket on, but he just seemed like he was really enjoying his time. So I wanted to share those little clips with you guys too, just because we're coming up on fall and winter here in Michigan, so I'm not gonna be in the water till next summer probably. All right, we're just gonna, we're just gonna kinda walk, she's gonna walk him over there. We're having her do it because as more of a nurturer. Oh, guys want to see more puppy update videos leave a comment down below let me know give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and you liked seeing kind of what these boys are up to lately dude's just back there laying again <laughs> but i hope you enjoyed this video make sure sub to subscribe if you guys haven't subscribed to this channel yet and we will see you really soon in the next video